Hello, my name is Kevin Cruz. I work for Kodak Pixpro, and this is the Orbit 360 4K. So we developed this product to sort of help push the or gap the bridge between regular action cameras and 360 degree cameras. And so what's unique about this camera versus the other cameras is that it's got two different field of views and that's so that one of the field of views can do a, a, a flat 4K resolution and then the other half can compensate to create a full 360 degree uh, uh, video and photo. And so you're, it's basically a bridge camera between action cams and 360 cams. And so we really designed it so that the user can have an easy transition from their traditional flat video recording to 360 recording. This camera is definitely a more consumer-centric uh, design because it has internal stitching. And so um, the big problem with 360 cameras in the past was that you had to do your own stitching. And so not only did for our last camera, we had to develop a stitching software for the user, but this time with this new camera, we have it all internally stitched. It's an instantaneous stitch. And so you can actually stream it already stitched and, you, and it's already captured stitch. Well, we just got these and I'll probably be the first beta tester and I have not yet started beta testing. And so, uh, and so I'm very excited to get my hands on it finally here at CES. And so after CES, I'll be starting my beta testing on the camera. Uh, I'm really excited. I think it's gonna be a really nice camera. Um, I, I like to see the market keep growing as 360 cameras are very new in general and the concept um, behind them is still fun, uh, fuzzy for people. And so hopefully this camera will bridge that gap for people as they transition from flat to 360. Um, it'll be available around spring and the projected price is between four and five hundred bucks.